real quickly get the uh, next ship loaded up. And the last ship of the day is going to be, uh, it was the WTF from Sidelined Angel. I have no idea what this ship is looks like or the gimmick of this ship. I hope it's not you die over and over. <laughs> but hey, maybe that'd be a great way to send you all off to your Thanksgiving break or me off to my Thanksgiving break. Salty as hell. Alrighty. So yeah, that last ship was Fex Told You. That was really an interesting ship. That was a uh, challenge mechanic at the beginning that I didn't think was going to actually work, but we got enough scrap, I guess. it. I guess the scrap recovery arm plus the whole repair drone and 100 drone parts was to cover the fact that it was kind of weak early game. So it kind of has its own... Um, trade-off. Weak offense and defense, but a lot of support systems. Oh no, it's a beast. Okay, Sideline Angel ship is apparently a beast. Did it win, Reese? We we won. Got slightly dicey at the end, but we got it. We got there. Alrighty. Let's see. Okay. So it doesn't look any different. Unless I uh, loaded it wrong. All right. Uh, let's see which ship it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> WTF is this? Hey, what's up, fish? Okay. Whoa. So that's eight. You should never see this. I think these might be ASBs. This modified Crestral class ship was created by a laser weapon aficionado. <laughs> hey, first time anybody's used aficionado in the description of a ship. Okay, so we have eight weapon power. We have eight PDS shots. <laughs> Two automated reloaders and a weapon pre-igniter. You know, this is the kind of ship I'd like to play right before break. It's like, it's like when you're in school. And right before Christmas break, your science teacher's like, you know, we're going to watch a movie for the last day of class. I don't want to teach anything. Y'all don't want to learn anything. Nobody wants to take notes. Let's watch freaking, I don't know, what's a movie everybody likes? Um, I was going to say Star Wars, but <laughs> um, let's watch freaking, I don't know, Matrix or something. WALL-E. We're going to watch WALL-E. There you go. <laughs> okay. So I know that when you put eight weapons on a ship, you can't auto fire five, six, seven, and eight, or else I think it breaks. Frozen, we're gonna all watch Frozen. All the boys in class are like, oh man, all the girls are like, yay. <laughs> oh man. Seems like the default default description, maybe it is. But this ship is from uh, this lovely design. This is from Sideline Angel. Are you here? Yeah. This might be a good ship for a golf low score run. All right. Let's see what PDS shots do. Ah, uh, it is ASBs. <laughs> so that's 12 damage. So, uh,. I'm curious if uh, having auto fire will break one, two, three, and four. You stepped out to the cookie time screen work. It did, Biohazard. It did. Thank you for that. Oh, wow. He dodged two. 24 damage in one shot possible. Yeah. I'm not going to fire these because I can't use hot hotkeys with it. So I'm going to have to, I would have to manually do it. Well, that's weird. Will it even work? I might actually need to test to make sure these work. Actually, I think if I do that with auto fire on, that's when it... Okay. So I can't have auto fire on with that. PDS shot is the ASB. Yes. It will happen to be three times, but it clears up... Uh, wait. Reminder, weapon five through eight. Watch for triangle. If you see a triangle, don't target. Okay. All right. I just saw what that was. So, So I have to target them like this. But I can go... One, two, three, four, like this. 
<laughs> Please stop firing these at us. No, sorry, I can't. I can't stop it. <laughs> Golf score run, huh? Well, that would be too short of a run. We're gonna we're gonna try to get. Well, I might I might. I'm gonna have at least a little bit of fun with this ship. At least a little bit of fun. What could we find from a store? Hacking so they can't dodge. I wonder if this would one-shot any of the boss phases. I'm not actually sure. Like, I don't think this could one-shot phase three of the boss. This is totally broke, you think? <laughs> Boss is 30, right? Well, I know double glade beam can do it, and double glade beam is what? Three times four rooms. 12 is 24. So, I think phase one, I think it's never more than 24, right? You start with a uh, pre igniter and two automated reloaders, some Saren. Drone control is a pain because they overlap. Yeah, I'm gonna not get drone control probably. <laughs> I like how these things are stacked on top of each other. <laughs> you just stack the weapons on top of each other. It's funny. You're rebelling against BS. You're feeling sad for the enemies. <laughs> it's okay. You can feel sad for them. I'm going to kill them over and over. And laugh maniacally. Probably 20 or so you can do first and second phase. I'm one. Well, what I really want to get, I want to get hacking and cloaking. Because if I can hack piloting, I want to one shot the boss phase one, phase two. And then I'm curious how many shots it'll take to kill him phase three. Think the ship is a little overpowered, you think? Uh, I don't want to fire a warning shot. I want to fire a warning shot from this ship will kill you. <laughs> fire warning shot. Oh, our warning shot blew up the planet. Uh, crap. We need to be more careful with our warning shots. <laughs> a warning shot from the Death Star destroyed a moon. That was my warning shot. <laughs> Make a PDS ship. The model for the ship was snipped from the background of the ASB Rebel Fights. The description was, why are we using the Kestrel when this background ship is so much stronger? That's funny. Uh... Warning shot to the back of the head. <laughs> That's right. All right, store. Uh, I can go one, two, three, four. Let's do it. No, no, something is not powered. Bye bye, auto surveyor. Bye bye. Excuse me. Okay. All right, so cloaking or hacking. I couldn't afford cloaking, but I could afford hacking. And of course, cloaking is what they have. Um, and I don't have anything to sell. Nothing, not, I can't possibly sell any of these things. So we'll just go ahead and get backup battery. And second shield. There we go. You can easily die with a ship, so you can do whatever in maps. Can someone double the amount of ASBs that are currently on the ship? <laughs> it's not overpowered enough. No, oh, no, I accidentally activated the ship. What will we do? Wow, he just blocked two of those. One with a... How the hell did he do that? So one of his shots blocked one. The, uh, the hacking blocked the other one. <laughs> wow. Auto hacker, freaking beastly there. You probably could have also added a few ASB artillery, but that may have been over the top. Yeah, you think that would have been too much? <laughs> uh, store, oh, there would be nothing we could get from the store. Needs more DACA. A Vulcan ASB. <laughs> Uh, all right, who's going to design the ship with the Vulcan ASB? Who's going to make that happen? Vulcan Flak ASB. It shoots flaks of ASB shots at Vulcan speed. Couldn't couldn't possibly be too OP there, right? Damn, no hacking still. Couldn't have afforded it anyway, but still. But still. 
Vulcan Flak ASB. Just try to think of the most overpowered thing we can think of. Don't tap me, Rand. You know I can. <laughs> uh, basic laser ASB. Oh my god. <laughs> Chain burst laser. Who would ever want you? What the? What kind of ship am I looking at? That seems insanely OP. <laughs> That's just a normal. Just a normal ship. Nothing OP about this. It's just, it's just eight ASB shots. I don't know what everybody's whining about. God. Damn, that's two stores with cloaking. And not hacking. All right, store. How about you have hacking, please? Vulcan ASB flak with fire. Since it's already a guaranteed uh, a breach. Uh, just start it with 0.1 second intervals and see the solid beam of ASB shots. That would break. That would break the game so fast. That is three ships, three stores with cloaking and no hacking. What the hell? I thought cloaking was rare. Come on, game. Trolling me with cloaking. This game is actually trolling me with cloaking shops. Eight AS beams sees perfectly normal and balanced. Burst laser two ASB. <laughs> no, I still like the flak ASB idea. I think flak ASB is where it's at. Oh, he did get on my ship. <laughs> Nothing OP about this. Proceeds to disintegrate every enemy with one shot. Yes. Perfectly balanced and normal ship. FTL wants you to have cloaking. And I'm telling FTL, I want hacking. So you can't dodge my ASBs. And the game's like, please take cloaking. I don't want to be unable to dodge all your ASBs. I'm going to save all my dodges... To have the boss dodge all of the ASB shots. All systems like shields and drone control are the same rarity. Oh, are they really? Shields and drone control? Are they more rare or less rare? I did not know that. I did not know that drone control and shields had a different rarity than other systems. If you get cloaking and stealth weapons, then they will never see it coming. <laughs> Very true. And before boss has the same setup. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, I would deserve that, wouldn't I? Playing a ship like this. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Still needs anti-missile? Not really. If, if I'm one shot in the boss, what do I need anti-missile for? Thank you for going to the... Heal base, stupid humans. Doodly -doo, doodly -doodly -doo -doo. Although the anti missiles would be cloaking, which cloaking and hacking are the two systems I want to get. So now you want to see a ship with eight Vulcans. We have had a ship with four Vulcans uh, before, I think, or four. The Star Destroyer from was it Zack Dog? Had, I believe, four Vulcans and four Glaive Beams. But you couldn't even power them all. Can't even power eight four-power weapons. Not OP enough. All right. Come on, hacking. Shields is 100% chance to show up. Think drone controls at 50%. Do the test over 100 stores selling systems. Got the video on YouTube under the name FTL, the Shields Experiment. Cool, Biohazard. I'll have to check that out. So I've actually wondered if Shields is 100% showing up at stores when you don't have it. And I thought that it was, but it's still not 100% because you can get a store with no systems, I guess. So, All right, now we want cloaking and we're ready for the boss. Yeah, maybe a little power. Wow, the ship even starts with backup battery. Oh, crap. <laughs> yeah, I bet that did take a while to test that. Biohazard, huh? Damn, no free... No free NG. No free NG, not even overpowered. Man, I guess I would get rid of one... Um, automated reloader for a Zoltan shield. If you twisted my arm. 
Use the mod testing environment mod to spawn stores. Oh, okay. Okay, I was gonna say. I hope you'd at least use a speed up mod or something for that. Training the evade and shield will be quite difficult now. Yeah. You know what you don't need shield and evasion training for, though? One-shotting the boss. <laughs> Damn! Not even a one-shot on this guy. I have to use my other weapons. Okay, so we want empty jumps, so not distress beacons to get sold in homeworlds. I'm going to enjoy this run. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna rush it. Oh, by enjoy this run, I mean get three-man freaking ball, man. That if they had boarding, this would be a five mantis, five-man mantis boarding ship right here. Whoops, that's not the door room. Crap. Uh, okay. Okay. Um. Damn it, he went into doors. Okay. Okay, go in the heel bay. Damn it. Uh, this is really bad. I actually need to fix my OT. Okay, I have to deal with the borders first. Okay, we gotta force them into the heel bay is what we need to do here. There we go. Okay. Nope. Let me get my mantis in there, please. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> Freaking hell. Talking about how OP my ship is and then just get wrecked by a bunch of mantis boarders. Okay. All right. All right. Everything's fine. Nobody's dead. It's fine. It's just a little scary. Just a little scared there for a second. Wonder if you'll meet an enemy with like two ASBs. No, I don't. I mean, I'm pretty sure. I mean, Silent Angel, correct me if I'm wrong. You didn't. This is not a weapon that we enemies can spawn with. Because even though it looks like a heavy laser, it's not actually a heavy laser changed to be this thing. This is what the PDS is when you load it or whatever. The rarity is at zero, you think? Rut row, this could be bad. Nah, we're fine. We're fine. Damn, not even a... Okay, it's still a one-shot. Even with him dodging one. <laughs> you're out of You're out of this BS. Okay. There's suspense on how it's going to end the run. There's... Okay. All right, cool, Raul. You're salty because I'm having fun. Cool. Well, uh, enjoy your day. I'm going to enjoy the rest of my run. So... Uh... I am not sad that I'm having fun. If the creator changed the rarity, it's certainly possible. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if uh, if Sideline Angel did that. Like, there's no suspense if you're never going to have a chance to lose. Cool. Cool. Imagine being salty at a streamer having fun playing a video game. Imagine that in 2015. Wait, what year are we in? Hacking's nice and all, but it might be better to buy four Mantis and fully upgrade doors just in case anyone thinks that boarding is your weakness. Um, boarding is my weakness. Um, so I might need to do something like... I don't think I'd want to get Teleporter, but getting, getting Mind Control would be a good idea. Mind Control would be the other system I actually want to get. Yeah, I want to get Cloaking and Mind Control, then we'll be fine against borders. You're not that talented to change the rarity of the weapon. <laughs> if you now also get cloaking, you could cloak the Rebel ASB and farm infinite score. Yeah. You could, but people have done that before, and that's just too boring. I'm never going to do that. It is current year, 2019. What year is it? I don't know. <laughs> Damn it. They know my weakness, guys. They know my weakness. They know. God, and they are exploiting my weakness. Holy crap. That is... Two Mantis boarding events in like a couple jumps here. Is this level three cloaking with a burst laser three and two free Mantis boarders? What the hell? Is he actually going to get this shot off? Holy crap. This is some BS right here. This is like sector two, I think, this ship. All right. Well, I'm going to ASB every single... 
room in your ship. And he's still gonna do damage to me. Oh god. Holy crap. Okay, that is actually insane. I think that was an event right there. I think that was an event fight right there. Jesus. That was a five power weapon system with level two at least cloaking. Holy crap, that was ridiculous. I gotta see, what sector are we in to have that? Rand's weakness is what year it is. That was sector three that I just had that five power weapon system. Friggin' insanity right there. Maybe upgrade doors. Eh. <laughs> I want a store so I can get cloaking. I'm trying to save up for cloaking is what I'm trying to do right now. So that's why I'm not spending all the scrap that I have. For Raul's sake, I hope you lose. Raul needs this one. <laughs> not because you're having fun, because it's a little too easy. Feel it's not satisfying, even if it's dessert after the last run. All right, all right, that's fine. You're welcome to feel that way, cool Raul. But I'm not going to feel guilty about playing an overpowered ship. I mean, I, I didn't design this. <laughs> I'm playing a ship somebody else designed to be overpowered. And so, it's fine if you are don't want to watch. Uh, again, I'm not trying to make you feel guilty for leaving. I'm just saying, I'm not going to feel guilty for having fun. Okay, well, uh, I, I guess Zoltan Shields actually block this ASB, which is different than normal ASBs. Nice. Rand, you need mantises, an army of them. All right, I have enough for cloaking, and that was the whole reason I did that. You should. Thank you, Cool Raul. This is BS, says the guy with OP weapons. <laughs> that guy's too overpowered. Nerf. Uh, I would like long-range scanners. There's, speaking of army of mantids. Um, problem is, if I buy anything here, apart from long-range scanners, I couldn't afford cloaking if it was, like, another store over here. I'm going to sell one automated reloader for long-range scanners. Because I still have enough for cloaking. FTL except every rebel enemy is the, the under construction flagship. Now that would be an interesting mod right there. How does uh, Zoltan Shield affect ASB? You didn't catch it? Hey, we actually got the Zoltan Shield quest right there at the end. Um, normally it doesn't block it if you have Zoltan Shield and it's a real ASB from the event. Because this is actually in a, a weapon ASB, it actually blocked, Zoltan Shield blocked it. So. Because we're shooting a projectile, the Zoltan Shield blocks it. A French that is nice to change things. Talking of yourself, okay. Damn. Punished for being a douchebag, trying to steal their stuff. Man Man actually thinks he's gonna get the cloaking now after skipping three of them in a row. <laughs> yeah, you're right. You're right, I did skip cloaking three times. Although, in my defense, I actually didn't have enough scrap to get it unless I sold one of these things. I don't, and I don't know how much they sell for, or sell, sold an automated reload or something, but, yeah, true. True. My fault for skipping three cloakings. <laughs> okay, um, I guess I could dive for this store, and if I get cloaking, I mean, even if I don't get cloaking... Alright, I guess we're diving. We're gonna see how, how strong our diving is. Damn, we didn't get the cloaking. I might buy NG though. Buy NG for blue options. We'll do that. Now we have doors upgraded. Alright, we'll see you later, cool Raul. Have a good one, my friend. Alright, um... Do I upgrade my engines? No, we're gonna one-shot the guy because I'm gonna hack his piloting so he can't dodge anything. Heal burst. May I be the injury? Uh, sure, Electro Hail. I'll try to remember to do that after this. After I finish my dive here. Okay, so I gotta do these one at a time. This is our practice, like if this was the boss fight. Have an ASB in every single one of your rooms, sir. GG. <laughs> what is not to love about this run? I don't know why Cool Rebel wasn't having a good time. <laughs> We just ASB'd every single room in that dove ship.
Do we do we even get out? We even get out right before it fires. Lovely. I have long range scanners. And Zoltan shields block my shots. So let's go slug home nebula. Unlimited power. Breach sound intensifies. You want to be the human? Okay. All right. So uh, Electro Halo is the NG. Is that right? Yeah. The Electro Halo 8. And Avenue Philanthropist, you can be my never trained pilot. Yeah, your name doesn't quite fit, sadly. This is why we need engines so we can get out of dodge quicker for, like, stun suns as well. We don't need anything. We have eight. We are so overpowered, people don't want to watch this run. We don't need anything. <laughs> we are so overpowered, people think this is not fun. Wow. Thought they were actually going to survive an entire volley there. You're always just eight. You are just always eight. Hashtag hummus rights. <laughs> Attack! Oh, do defense drones shoot down ASB shots? Now that's something I don't know. I would guess defense two would, but defense one wouldn't. Okay, defense one does not shoot down ASB shots. This is fun run. This is very fun. I'm having a blast. <laughs> I'm having a literal blast. Oh, God. I just made a pun. Defense 2 will. Just fire these until till they're dead. Uh, let them live. Because that's, the, uh, that's the Slug Home World's quest. Damn. Five fuel. That was most likely not worth. I think this run is hugely entertaining. OP ships are great after a few challenging runs. Yeah. Well, I guess the other thing is... Since I've been playing so many viewer-created ships lately, they're either ridiculously overpowered or broken and don't work. So there's not a, lot of, not a lot of challenging middle ground for some of these runs. So I can understand somebody thinking this is not fun to watch. But uh, eventually I'll have to go back to real FTL playing. But y'all keep sending me ships and I just want to keep playing them. So... All right. All hail the superior race. Humans are superior. Oh, my God. Embrace the humanist run. Man, sounds like some people in chat need to get vented. All right, cloaking. All I want... A rebel scum in chat, that's right. All I want is cloaking. No cloaking. Okay. Well, um, since no cloaking, we will... Get some dodge. We'll get doors. I need to keep 150 scrap. Uh, we are we are in a slug sector, so I should have gotten these already. We'll get the level 202 so we can do that. Vent all the humans. Get vented, chat. <laughs> You'll see the safer stream we provide. Well, you won't, but you get the point. You'll see the safer stream. Hmm? Uh, ignore Slocknog, and then rescue Slocknog. All right, welcome, you shield trained slocknog, you. Um, do I even care about the training? I'm just going to have you be on piloting, actually. And we'll put you on weapons, human. Again, we're never getting dodge training, so might as well have immunity to mind control going on. There should be a mod for 10 augments so you can get a pre-igniter and 9 automator reloaders for a single basic laser. How would that be different than a Vulcan? I mean, it'd be a faster Vulcan. If you're going to mod it, just make a faster Vulcan. You just quote, quoted one of the rebel ships is what you were doing. Okay. All right. I'm going to sell. You, we're, you know what we're going to do? I'm going to sell a um, an augment. So I have room for Zoltan Shield, and then I'm going to get... You know what's going to happen. We're going to get freaking... What's his face? Um, what is his name? I don't even know. Let's get Clone Bay. Envoy. We're going to get freaking Envoy. You would like to see 10 auto loaders to see what the game would do? <laughs> Reconciliation our deals without war. True progress can only be achieved about bloodshed and a Zoltan Shield. Damn it. <laughs> did I call it or did I freaking call it? 
Uh, I freaking called it. Damn it. They knew because I sold my automated reloader. They're like, oh, this guy doesn't want to waste scrap. <laughs> Let's make him waste scrap. <laughs> rude. Freaking rude game is rude. Flashbacks to the Pew Pew ship where every basic layer laser was terrifying. It was terrifying, but it was also hilarious. See, to me... You know what? I'm having fun. Let's dive some more. To me, OP ships are sometimes as terrifying as they are, are fun because of something like that where the enemy ends up having one of the OP things. That doesn't happen often, but... Okay, we want information. Quest marker. Cool. So that's kind of the trade-off. Sometimes sometimes your OP-ness gives the enemy an OP-ness. And when everybody has an OP-ness, nobody is OP. And you can quote me on that. Uh, the goal is to have something that makes sense, but something that is silly and funny. Yeah. Ten auto loaders would, re would work since it wouldn't be more than 100% reduction. Okay. She had a brilliant idea. A rock ship with a four-man teleporter and three mantis pheromones. Haha. <laughs> I, I, I'm trying to remember. I think I might have had a ship where somebody made rocks fast, but it's been a while. That would be pretty fun to, to play with. Seeing rocks zooming around a ship. <laughs> that would be pretty cool. Can you sell the anti-biobeam and then they'll have anti-biobeam in stores? <laughs> nah, why would I do that? Anti-biobeams never show up in stores. We don't, we don't want to mess that up. All right, now we will get... Here we go. Five engines for getting out of here fast, like we need it. Did I just say OPNIS? It's all about which OPNIS is bigger. <laughs> it's not the size that counts. It's how you use it. Oh, wait. Nope. Whoops. Must hack engines. Wait, I can't unaim this shot. The hell? Well, that was weird. I think I just bugged the thing to give me two shots with that. Did I just use that one maneuver? Oh, that was this one. But it said one. Oh. Oh, that's how those work. So it's thinking five, six, seven, eight is actually one, two, three, four again. Weird. That was confusing me. Anti-biobeam salesman slaps top of anti-biobeam. This right here, this old baby right here. <laughs> you won't find this just in any store, actually. If you can't, you can't find it in stores. What a liar. What a liar. Salesman is a liar. Oh, God. In order to get this... This slug quest, I have to waste two jumps. So it'd be slug repair gel... And, like, a weapon or something? So I wouldn't get this store if I do it. Anti-biobeam salesman does sound like a slug. <laughs> this baby right here. He'll melt your enemies so fast. Uh, God, I guess I'll do this. What a, what a trolley. Uh, of course, the most trolley quest location it could possibly have is where it is. Most challenging part of this ship is just shooting my other weapons. Anti-biobeam equals new bug spray. All right, we will get that store then, at least. Hopefully that store has cloaking. Okay. All right. Try to tail them without being noticed. Slug crew, have your crew member monitor life signatures. Okay, you have a glaive beam. <laughs> uh, slug repair gel. There we go. We traded an automator reloader for a slug repair gel. Who got the better end of the deal there? It sounds like I made a deal with a slug for that. Slug salesman flops body on the car. <laughs> this baby can find me found so many shops. <laughs> is, that, is that how slugs <laughs> sell their wares? Flopping their bodies on top of it. <laughs> well, there's mind control. So I still have space for cloaking. So we'll go ahead and get mind control. 
Let's blame it right here. Oh, God, you got slime all over it. I'm not touching that. What? What? I smell fine. No, it's nice. It's just, it's, uh, it's normal slug body odor. Don't worry about it. <laughs> uh. Head on down to Crazy Randy Ship Surplus, where we have all the anti-bio beams you could never find at stores. One, two, three, four, five. Nice. <laughs> Crazy Randy ship surplus. <laughs> Come on, where's my cloaking? Jesus. Apparently cloaking is the most ra uh, rare thing in the game now. You've seen it three times. You don't get to see it again. I'm not getting the scrap recovery arm. Not doing it. You don't know if slugs have hands, so... <laughs> uh. Okay, can I get third shield? I can even get a power for it. Beautiful. Hey, Rand, you know you can get cloaking in stores? No, I don't believe you. I feel like I've never seen that before, ever. Tra la 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 la. Tra la 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 la. Actually, we have mind control. Let's do this kill your friend. And then we'll kill you later. Slug salesman isn't a slug. Extends body jelly onto car. Just doesn't sound very good. <laughs> I don't know. Sounds perfectly normal to me. Newton's third law. Roof of anti-bio beam slaps you back. <laughs> what? I don't even know what that means. Uh, all right. Um... We'll farm a little score here. We'll get double distress and then dive. Whoops. I did not mean to depower you. Wow, look at those dodges. That guy actually survived a full... Okay, he didn't survive a full volley. That guy almost survived a full volley of all of my weapons. Of all of my crazy stuff. They're just pirates. Oh, cloaking plus good weapons. That is what beats us. Um, actually, doesn't really beat us. Just makes makes it slightly annoying. For every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction of the the. Um, roof slapping the anti-bio beam back or something. Well, I knew it was a Newton's third law joke. I just didn't quite know where it was going. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> All right, ASB. We are going to uh, hack your piloting. Make it so you can't dodge. Backup battery mind control. Deal with those guys. Six, seven, eight, go. Kill the humans. <laughs> Pretty fun breach sound, though. And now, no matter how OP we are, it's a pretty fun breach sound. I'm a fan of that. You're gonna go pr go be productive now. All right, we'll see you later, Reese. Have a good one, my friend. Thanks for hanging out. Okay. Um. What am I looking for again? Cloaking. <laughs> I was like, I know there's something I want on this run. My control unit actually was allowed through doors. That's interesting. Yes. Uh, if you didn't know. If a crew is mind controlled, they can actually walk through doors like they own the place. So that's something that at some point I don't know that I knew, but I've known that for a while. Didn't know that I knew, but now that I know that I didn't know another that I know it, I know it. What's up, X dude? How are you doing? There it is, finally cloaking at a store when we have scrap for it. Do any of that stuff? Uh, nope. So that was our final system. Do, 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 do. 
Hey, don't mind control my guys. I'm supposed to do that to you. Okay. Let's see if we one shot through Zoltan Shield here. So if we don't do it here, we definitely don't do it to the boss. Hmm. Interesting. I'm guessing we don't one shot the final phase of the boss, sadly. Whole beam is pretty good weapon for boss fight, Ran. <laughs> You're right, I do need to swap out my weapon system. This isn't very good. Still just points that you can't use mind control to move enemy crew around like normal crew, yeah. Well, there's a lot of things that I wish you could do controlling wise. Number one would be controlling your boarding drones. Then I think they'd actually be usable. I think boarding drones are actually not. I don't want to say not usable. They're. I mean, we saw it last run. They're not reliable offense. That was one miss. Really? There was only one miss when he dodged all those shots? Felt like more. Okay, let's go. This. This. This, this. Go. You're fine. Been apprenticing, so could not usually watch your streams that much, but tomorrow getting up later, so now you're here. Nice. Well, glad to see you here, X-Dude. I'm about to go out of town for Thanksgiving, so uh, I won't be here for the next couple days, but I'm glad that... I hope your apprenticing is going well. I hope you're learning a lot. And I don't know. Do you make money as an apprentice, or is it like an internship where you don't make money until you finish it? Finish him. Maybe more, but that's why you didn't kill the Zoltan Shield, I mean. Oh, uh, because there was one miss, and that's why I didn't one-shot the Zoltan Shield. Well, you got to remember also, the boss has uh, more Zoltan Shields than normal Zoltan Shields. Gone for five minutes, and suddenly you got cloaking. Yes, finally we got the cloaking. No internship. Are you making fun of me being a Finn? What? Why would I make fun of you being a Finn? No, I'm not making fun of you at all. I was... Genuinely curious if you were making money, because I would hope you would be. Am I winning this fight? Nope. <laughs> Poor Slocknog. Damn it, Slocknog. You're not supposed to die. Uh, so you're not making money? Oh, well, that does suck. But, hey, I hope you are learning. I mean, if you're doing an internship or a... Uh, what do you call it? Apprenticing. Hopefully it's something that you care about, though. And are enjoying. Didn't get a money deal, but for next year, maybe? Cool. Well, I hope so. Well, and I would assume if it's like other things, maybe if you... After apprenticing for a year or however long you'll do it, you'll... The next one you get will be a paid one. Because you'll have the experience to go along with it. Okay. That's weird. Why'd you ask if I was making fun of you for being a Finn? Seems weird. One, two, three, four, five. I don't think I can get seven. One, two, three, four. Maybe find a store over there, though. Let's go for that. Electrician is the deal. I feel like electricians probably make a lot of money. But I don't know. Uh, okay, let's get value point and cloaking. Anything else we get is gravy. I said something about finishing. Oh, oh. Wow, I made a pun about being a finish and I didn't even know it. Well, apologies if it sounded like I was... You know how I feel about puns, so it definitely wasn't on purpose. <laughs> the punning was not intentional, I assure you. My punning is never intentional. I actually don't want to lose uh, Envoy's training, so we're going to do this. Hey, a free weapon. Oh, crap. That is five mantids on my ship. Yikes. That is a lot of mantids. Alright, come on in so I can kill you. Nice. Do 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 do. Ran tries to avoid puns at all cost. At all cost. Here it's like 2500 E for XP of 0 to 2. What? It says like it costs money to get experience of 0 to 2 years? Is that what you're saying? I'm not exactly sure what that sentence means. Oh, okay. There's a store. 1, 2, 3. 
warp. One, two, three. Right, I guess we do that. Puns are not my bag, of baby. All right, here, let's see if we, we have better luck with this volley of getting through Zoltan Shields. Come on, let's one-shot a guy. Show me it's possible. Wow, it's two dodges. Hey, but we did one-shot him. All right. Got a one-shot on that one. For electrician, pay with zero to two years experience. Oh, okay. I don't know what, 2,500 euros? Is that a month, a year, a day? <laughs> Because 2,500 euros sounds like a lot, but I don't know what the time frame is. If that's in a year, probably not very much. Automated reloader, huh? Well, since we're not getting Zoltan Shield, I guess we get this. That's a month. Okay, seems pretty good. Definitely more than I make a month, that's for sure. Well, except for the month of December when I'm singing like crazy. Then I make... I don't know how euros translates to dollars, so... I don't know. Sam the station? Oh my god, so many borders, man. They know my weakness. They know my weakness. I do this, will you go in there? No. Okay. <laughs> Please, we want to surrender! No, no, I have a couple more ASB shots for you, though. Doodly -doo -doo. God, the breach sounds are crazy. Do, 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 do. 2,500 euros is about $2,750. Okay, for a month of work, that seems pretty good to me. I mean, to some people out there, that probably sounds like chump change, but to me, to my history of money-making endeavors, that sounds pretty darn good. I mean, what, what would that be a year? 2,500 times 12 would be what? 5,000 times 6, 30,000. 30,000 a year or a little more? I guess that's middle class wages, right? In the US, I think that's middle class. And that's without overtime or other add-ons, true. Yeah, and if you get like healthcare covered, or maybe you already get that if you live in Finland, because in the US usually you don't get free healthcare, your company often often provides it. Do we get the one shot? Hey, that's a one shot. Blows nose using $100 bills. Pathetic. <laughs> Jump change. Learn to make money, noobs. You and Trump are like this, right? You're hanging out at all the billion dollar strip clubs and stuff. Okay, do I have long range scanners? I don't, do I? I do, actually. Okay, let's go through the nebula then. <laughs> Blows nose using $100 bills. I would take used nose blown in hundred dollar bills it's not that hard to clean them i'll take them if you're not going to use them I'll, I'll hold on to those for you give me the trash can you throw those away in i make a better deal he's gonna attack me okay no surrender we have workplace health insurance and normal insurance okay okay store kind of a dead end i don't really need anything so we will not go there all righty <laughs> that's cute you have four shields you say you're so cute with your four shields like that's going to protect you from anything eat my asb shorts man wow we're actually not one-shotting these guys might have to actually use cloaking for a missile volley. <laughs> yeah, not having the dodge is a little bit of a pain, actually. Not having the dodge and uh, not having 100% <laughs> when we have cloaking is it's the price we pay for one-shotting everybody with eight ASB shots. Best overtime you've heard of for electrics is like 90 euros. Wow. Okay. Uh, I don't really want to mess with half power. Let's go ahead and get our fourth shield. We got level two sensors because why not? I'm going to get max clone bay. Nah, not yet. Uh, attack the pirate. Oh, you have a Zoltan shield. So 
so many Zoltan Shield ships this run. When I grab this weapon, I sometimes open my doors. That's a little interesting. Oh, one off lethal. I was watching YouTube and thought, hey, I'll see you streaming. Hey, what's up, Poison Joke? You got here just at the nick of time, too. This is my final run of the day. So, welcome. And uh, welcome from the YouTube to the live stream, my friend. Pull up a pull up a computer and have a cookie. <laughs> right, you have no cloaking or shield, so you must have insane dodges here. And enjoy us one-shotting a bunch of guys with P with ASB shots for the final run of of the day of the week, really, since I'm going out of town. You have little Kinder chocolate bars. They shall suffice. They sound delicious. I don't know if I've had a Kinder chocolate uh, chocolate bar, but anything that ends in chocolate bar, I would like to participate in by eating said thing. Um, let's see here. So let's max out this, 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 this. There. 98% dodge when we cloak is pretty good. Hey, all right. An engine trained guy. <laughs> so now my engines and piloting are immune to mind control. That's beautiful. And it gives me just enough dodge for 100% uh, dodge. Love it. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Ran tomorrow's special occasion is my conscription hearing, which means sitting for at least three hours. That doesn't sound fun at all. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. I'm going to have turkey for Thanksgiving, so you can think of me while you're sitting there for three hours bored out of your mind. If that'll make you feel any better. I'm guessing that probably won't make you feel any better. But that's what I'll be doing. <laughs> Eating turkey at my brother's house. But uh, I hope conscription hearing i don't know what that means uh we have uh we have uh the, we had the thing clone beta protect us from that damn that actually lost my training oh <laughs> that was the one worst guy that could have died to the giant alien spiders the guy that was giving me the 100 percent dodge damn now might actually not dodge all missiles while while cloaked God, so many dodges. You're so OP, man. Can't even one-shot you. Finish Defense Force conscri Conscription AK Military. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think you've probably told me about that before, haven't you? It's been a while since we've talked, so I forgot about that. Compulsory, compulsory enlistment for state service, typically into the armed force, forces. Yeah, conscription. I, I was thinking, like, something else. Like, what's that religious thing they do? Um... Confirmation. <laughs> Conscription and confirmation, two very different things. And I was thinking one and not the other. It's like, you're getting... Con you're going to be a confirmand? Okay, we're going to mind control that. Oh, blocked. Blocked the thing. Still have enough to kill you. Do I even go to the repair? Do I care? Now nah, let's finish this run. This has been, this has been a fun final run. Well done, Sidelined Angel, for making a beast of a ship. That has frickin' eight ASBs. This is just insane. Whoops. No surrender. Hoping either comms or electronic warfare. Wow, that's crazy that you... That they, that they do compulsory military service in Finland. Are there a lot of places around the U.S. that... Uh, around the U.S., around the world that still do that? Both are scams, so they're basically the same. <laughs> uh, you wish the UK did that? Well, I guess there's some sort of positive side to it, right? Like a lot of times it's like free training and something, and that's why you're hoping for electronic stuff. So you can uh, basically get your training paid for and some stuff. So I guess that's kind of the upside of it getting training paid for by the government basically you're fine with military 
Well, I ended up actually getting um, recruited in the military, in the army one time when I didn't want to be because in the U.S., the army recruiters and other military recruiters kind of like a lot of times trick you into joining, which is kind of what happened to me because I was in college, didn't mean to join, but had to go to the, what's it called? The um, recruitment drive or whatever they did. And I, I was like, I'm, I'm actually in college, don't want to do this. But the guy's like, no, that's fine. Just sign here. And uh, it's not forced or anything, but just sign here. It's like, okay. I had to get my aunt, who was in the military, to get me out of it. Because I was like, I'm, I'm going to college as a music major. <laughs> I shouldn't have to do this, right? A lot of benefits, but we have other problems at the moment. Yeah, okay. Uh, you get free driving for trucks and other driving cards. Is that, is that different than just having a car? I don't know if I'm happy or sad the stream is coming to end. You should be writing your science article, but here I am watching. <laughs> Ran tricked into something. Surely you jest, sir. Yeah, that's never happened before. <laughs> All right, so he's hacking my weapons, which is the one thing that keeps me from one-shotting him. So I'm hoping my cloaking will last long enough to get the hacking over to make him not be able to dodge. No, this is not going to work, actually. Oh, it is going to work. Okay. One shot the shields guy. We'll one shot the pilot. I know. I've never been scammed in anything before. Hack it. There we go. <laughs> you hack my weapons, will you? I shall hack your life. Your brother is in the foreign and the French Foreign Legion. Interesting. Basically, got free occupational training also, so easier to get a job after military. It makes sense. I mean, I'm not knocking you doing it, but it's, it's just very different because for me, I never wanted to be in the military, and so the idea of being compulsed or forced to do it doesn't sit super well with me. But I'm American, and we're free, so don't make me do anything I don't want to do. Is probably kind of the mindset for a lot of people here. Okay, I would love to get one more power. All right, so that's one shot, phase one. Tricky like hell. Sign here for free cookies. Ha <laughs> ha, you fool. <laughs> Damn it. Anything but cookies and I could have turned them down. Actually, I can't really turn anything down, apparently. Because I signed up for a free timeshare. Well, not they didn't say it was free, but a really expensive time chair for a freaking free massage and alcohol that I never wanted to drink. So I'm not the good. I'm not the good. I'm not the best at saying no to things or being with people who don't know how to say no to things and me being the one who's supposed to say no. Uh, you're going to participate with paramilitary organizations. All right. I guess that means like in the job that you would have, you would be working for military people. So this makes good connections. Makes sense. Let's get power here. Mind control. Okay. All right. So now we get to the point where we can't one shot him in the final phase. That was an all right round two. It was fine. I mean, just, just a one shot. <laughs> but now we see where... How frail the ship really is. Need to close all the doors. Can't even one shot. Okay, we actually did one shot. There's ult and shield. That's pretty good. <laughs> but we didn't we didn't one shot any damage into the ship, so we'll just have to we'll just have to do two volleys. I mean, I guess it's kind of like the uh, double glaive beam. We'll just have to get through the zone shield before we one shot your face. <laughs> GG, get wrecked. Bam. That was the, uh, what was the ship called? The, not the Red Tail. This was the WTF from Sidelined Angel. <laughs> the freaking WTF. Flawless victory. Yes, Americans don't have compulsory service, but we do have the draft. So we know if we get drafted that it's because we're in trouble. We don't stand to gain much from it. Okay. Now you're trained for the defense of the nation as you are a civilian without being in the military. Okay. Yeah, that was that was definitely fun. Let's check the score. 58-95. Yeah. Beautiful.
Nice big high score. GG cookie time. We've earned it. Am I going to have a cookie? Um, I'm actually about to eat my lunch, so probably not. Um, 55 ships defeated, 1,800 scrap collected. That was that was a fun couple of runs. What ship did you miss? You missed the WTF. Eight ASBs. Boring ship, uh, according to some people. But, uh, my friends, that is, that is going to do it for me. Thank you all so much for watching. I know it's a short stream. If you want to submit a ship, Fiddle Diddle just uh, posted the link there. You can upload a ship to that. Uh, to, you can upload a ship on Dropbox or Google Drive. PM me on Twitch or leave it in a YouTube comment or message me on, I think, my... I don't know if my Facebook... Probably not on Facebook. You can tweet it towards me, probably. But again, thank you all so much for watching. I'm going to head out because I'm going to... Uh, oh my god. Saucer just gifted five subs to end the stream. To Sideline Angel, Austere Man, Fiddle Little Cruel Angel, and Mafrost. Thank you so much, Saucer. Jesus, you are a gifting madman. Cruel Angel, you're the one that... Hold on a sec. Is Cruel Angel lurking? Because I got a, a ship called Breathless Shard, and I didn't have who it was from because I think it was linked in chat. I think that was Cruel Angel. Cruel Angel, did you send me a Breathless Shard? So I didn't have the name down right. But oh my god, Saucer, thank you so much for that, my friends. So that's the WTF done. Off my list there. Or completed on my list. It was Cruel Angel 1324 one, that did that. Okay. Cool. Let me let me get the full name on there. I like to make sure I'm crediting one three two four. Oh crap! I like to make sure I'm crediting the people who send me these ships, so I don't think people think it's my ship. Because I don't make things; I play things, often poorly. But uh, welcome all you wonderful people to the to the randoms, and thank you, Sasha, for the gift, and thank you all so much for all the wonderful things you do watching the stream. Bits, follow, subs, all the amazing things you all wonderful people do. I'm going to head out because tomorrow's Thanksgiving, so I'm going to head out now and go hang out with my brother and have some Thanksgiving dinner tomorrow. So for anybody who is having Thanksgiving, I hope you have a great holiday weekend. Anybody who doesn't have a holiday weekend, I hope you have a great normal weekend. Um, quick reminder that uh, the rest of this season through the end of December is going to be lots of streams happening at weird times or not happening or being shorter. So... Don't get offended. It's not because I don't want to stream. It's because I'm really busy with gigs. I have a lot and lots of singing Christmas caroling gigs this time of year. And so that's what's going to do it. So I feel like we should end with a raid, though. Let's see if there's any... With us ending early, we should definitely raid somebody. It won't be a huge raid, but if there's anybody to raid, we should definitely do it. So let me see if there's a friend... Oops. Uh, friend or other streamer that I think I'd like to uh, send you wonderful people to to end this stream. Uh, is there anybody? Phoenix C64 is playing some Darksiders 3. So let's do a, no, ah, Farb is streaming. And he's actually got way more people than I do. So let's do a little baby raid to Mr. Farb, who looks just like me, apparently. So, uh, let's raid the Farb. When we raid, we say, um, random raid. So, uh, where are you, Farb? Let's send the love over to Farb. So thank you all again so much for watching. You all are amazing. Have a great rest of your weekend. Love you all. Hope you have a good one. And uh, let's raid Farb and have a great rest of your uh, weekend, my friends. We will see you all next time. So uh, let's...